okay, I, I have to, this phone, you have to turn it off and change it to, to zoom out. So let's turn on the bathroom light. Uh, the bedroom's a decent size, but now we'll tell you that's a queen. So King's going to tighten it up a little bit in here. Um, they've got a, looks like a laminate. And this might be tile. No, it's some kind of laminate. Double sinks. They're low double sinks, which is the way they used to do them back in the 60s and 70s. Does have the original cast iron stove. Uh, they've epoxy stove, <laughs> bathtub. They've epoxied over the over the tile. They actually did a pretty decent job. Whoever did it, uh, commode is not comfort height. Uh, these were very common built-ins back in the day. Missing a little thing there. The vent has been updated. You can put a piece of wood uh, like one before us around that and paint it, and that would dress that up quite a bit. We've done that with. Uh, some of our flip houses. There is a dog door in the back of the house. So you've got three door access to the, to the backyard. Kind of like that. It's got dual AC filters. Nice size bedroom here. Um, probably could use a little bit of paint. Looks like they're getting ready to get out of here. Uh, moving on down the hallway, you've got a, another nice bedroom. Well, who did the floors, but they didn't do the thresholds properly in most places. Uh, you can't really tell, but you know, they didn't get the, get it covered properly. That's not a big deal. I guess somebody can do that if you're not a DYer and you've got a nice, nice size bedroom here as well. Uh, these double closets were very common back in the day. I'm going to go back and shoot the master closet real quick. Uh, I'm not not thinking as clearly as I normally do when I do these. I apologize. <clears throat> Medication and first one thing and another. Here's the other bathroom. We'll catch it before we get out of here. That, that is tile there. Um, nice size vanity in here. Uh, lighting has been updated. They've also epoxied the tile in here. Uh, you can epoxy refinish these tubs. Uh, this one doesn't look like it's ever been done, nor does the other one. So here's your your uh, other one. So I'm going to turn off these lights as I go. Let's go back and check out the master closet. Yeah, this is I've seen these this plan before it's usually a good closet yeah this is very rare in an older home to have this nice a master closet uh, plenty or plenty of space in here so um you know I, I mean honestly a king will fit if you didn't have this piece of furniture over here i don't think it would be a an issue but if you have that piece of furniture it's going to get tight right there so, um, guys, that's the house. I'm going to walk back to the, to the front of the house. We're going back out of the hallway. See if I can figure out what I did there. There we go. There's some little minor stuff, you know, that, but all in all for this house to be the age it is, it's actually in pretty good condition. So, um, yeah, I actually like the way they painted the fireplace. I, that usually was some of the old stone, and it just didn't look good. It dated the house bad. That kind of updated it some. You could replace cabinet doors, and that would update it more. Not that they, they're in bad condition, just if you wanted to get a little more updated feel to it. So we're coming back through turning off lights as we go. Um So that is this house, guys. Listen, I appreciate you letting me uh, let me show it to you. We're going to move on to the next one now.